Justin from Arizona made a sign so I could find him. Very cool, huh? Guy thinks of everything. It's gonna be a good trip. It's a really nice day. Chileo Campground. That's where we're starting our adventure from. We're gonna do the Bear Canyon through hike from Mount Wilson to Switzer's Falls picnic area. Checking out Switzer's Falls in the morning. It's late October and we got summer weather except for these winds. I'm here with Justin from Arizona and Catherine from San Diego. It's gonna be a great trip. I'm really looking forward to it. Beautiful weather today. And I'm really grateful that you came along. We're gonna have a good time. Take care. At the trailhead, it's Markham Peak. And there's the Greater San Gabriel Valley. I don't know if you can see it on the cell phone. But it should be a great weekend. And with Catherine and Justin, you're gonna have a lot of fun. Check it out. Looks like a full on back cave, doesn't it? <laughs> Built in 42 during the war. <laughs> Anyhow, this is Mueller Tunnel. It really looks like your conjured image of a tunnel. <laughs> it's a great day. Turn along and we see a car where I've never seen a car on the trail. I've never even seen Ranger vehicles here. And we went to check it out. It's got a special pass. He's a trail builder. He's got an administrative pass. Cool, huh? Wow, I've never seen that before. Right on, dude. Thanks for building us some trails. And there's the Pacific Ocean, downtown LA. It's a great day today. Bear Canyon, that's where we're headed. But this is great. You can see La Cañada, downtown LA, the Pacific Ocean. I think I see some of the islands out there, yep. A Little bit of haze, but with the naked eye, you can see quite a bit. I would imagine far less with this iPhone, but thanks for coming along, I'm grateful.
trail is barely marked here. Very slippery. In Upper Bear Canyon, I wanted to explore the headwaters, but it was dry with just puddles of water. Kind of sketchy trail too, but a lot of fun. Look at that overcrop. Okay, time to adventure hike. I'm gonna put the camera away. I call this one bushwhacking with my friends. <laughs> Gee, they handled it. Solo backpacker here. This is the part of the trail where you have to limbo, Jimbo. Here they come. You got poison oak on one side and a low bridge on the other. Uh, no problem. The upper narrows of Bear Canyon. It's beautiful. You got fall colors, lots of shade, and incredibly running water. It's a great weekend. Hey, look at this sweet camp spot we got. We got the southernmost spot at uh, Bear Canyon Trail Camp. And a lot of deadfall on the trail, but we crushed it. We crushed it. Let me show you uh, Catherine's tent. She's got this uh, Fly Creek too, it's dope. Pretty nice, huh? We're here with the Boy Scouts, they're hanging out. There's my rig. And we're posted up right here above the river. It's a great evening. Thanks for coming along. From the Solo Backpacker Field Research Center, Justin from Arizona has come up with an uh, incredible enhancement to existing gear. He's uh, turned his caldera cone into uh, the lightest barbecue I know for backpacking. And it looks like it's going to work great. So, Justin, great idea, man. Yeah. And you're going to eat that steak, right? I sure am. <laughs> Innovating on the trail. Solo backpacker, out. Nice. There's that grill. Justin's grill worked so well, I just said, hey, let me use it. And he was like, sure. Look at that. Got some bacon wrapped steak medallions. Good. Nice camp. Hanging out. Great company. Nice night. Justin got that fire roaring. Pretty cool. We're hanging out. Chilling out here at Bear Canyon Trail Camp. Having a great time. These stoves are amazing. Catherine and Justin went to get some water. We've got a near full moon. It's a really nice night. Thanks for joining us. There's deadfall all over this canyon, in the upper, and according to those Boy Scouts, in the lower. I wonder if some sort of wind event knocked the sign down too. The sign's on the ground, there's the pole. Bear Canyon Trail Camp. Getting ready to hike out. It's a pretty section on the way out. It's a lot of fun. You guys ready? Giddy up. Let's go. 
adventure hiking. I went up and over, they were smart. I made that look easy. <laughs> really flowing, it's four or five feet higher in the points. It's early spring, it's also cold, but the water's really low now. This spot right here, you could camp on that sandbar and swim in the morning. This is what it looks like late October. Justin from Arizona, above the falls, handling it. He took that rope right there, shimmied up there. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. It was a great hike. Like Switzer's Falls. Getting ready to walk out. The car's about an hour away. I'm out of power, but I really appreciate you coming along. And I really appreciate Justin from Arizona and Catherine from San Diego coming along. It was a lot of fun.